Hello IT Pros and welcome back to my IT workshop. This is your boy Alvin Drill and in this video I'm going to show you how to upgrade the firmware version of an HP home uh, printer. Okay, so for that end this is my desktop computer, can be a laptop, can be a desktop, in this case it's a desktop but that doesn't make a difference. And I'm using Windows 10 but it can work for Windows 8 as well and in the future Windows 11. So the printer we're going to use for this video is this one. So this is an HP LaserJet Pro M102W. As you can see, it's a very simple uh, printer. I have done a, I have done a video in the past on which uh, I have uh, upgraded the firmware of an HP printer as well. But this printer that you can see in the picture, it's a network printer. So it's big one. It has a, a little monitor screen on, built in, so you can see more features. It's easier to upgrade. But this model that you can see here is very basic. It's for your home, a small office. It's, it, it's not connected to the network. It only has like three buttons. It doesn't have a monitor. So how do you do it when you cannot even see the version that you have? Okay, so this is a black and white printer and it's connected using a USB cable from the printer to my desktop computer. Okay, so how do you see the firmware version? You don't have many features, many, uh, you don't have a screen on this uh, printer. So we're going to check that in a few more seconds. So let's, uh, let's go back to uh, the desktop computer. So if you're watching this video, most likely you already have the drivers installed. So your printer is working fine. It's printing, it's doing what it needs to do, and that's good. So as you can see, it's installed, but if you don't have it installed, I'm going to show you where to download the drivers, if you don't have it, but you need to have the drivers installed, okay? So while I'm telling you that, this is a good chance for you to like this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet. <coughs> I'm sorry. So let's, um, let's uh, go back to the printer. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to check what version, what firmware version I have. So in this model, to do that, I have these buttons on top. So I have to press the X for a few seconds until the green uh, circle starts blinking. So after that, I have to press the X for a few more seconds and then it's going to print. But in the video, I was messing around. I did it wrong at the beginning, but at the end, I was able to do it correctly. So then. Uh, it's going to start printing, as you can see there. The video is sped up, that's why you can see it very quick. And the information that we need, I'm going to show you right now, is this one. So, uh, as you can see, HP LaserJet, that's a model, configuration, and you see a lot of information. So the one we need is firmware date code. And as you can read, it says 2018-05-10. So the current firmware version is from 2018, so a long time ago, most likely, is the version with or the printer came okay so we need to upgrade it so uh, as you can see that's how you check the firmware version that you have now on the desktop computer you open a web browser i'm going to use chrome and you go to hp.com i'm going to leave the link in the description below so um, it's going to look different depending when you visit this website so it's not going to look the same so you go to support then you go to software and drivers you click on that then you have these options. By the way, if you want to know how to reset the BIOS password for an HP desktop computer, you can click in the top right of this screen for the video. So here, we are going to choose printer, of course, because that's what that's what we have. And in the, on this space, we are going to copy paste the model. So I just copy pasted the model for these uh, for the printer that we are using right now. And as you can see, HP Laser Pro and all the models. So you click on submit, and after a few seconds it should show you a, a website like, like this. So these are all the drivers that this printer has, okay? So uh, the first one is the one that you have to have installed. Again, most likely you already have it installed. If you don't have it, you scroll down a little and you can download it, all right? But you need it before we can upgrade the firmware version. So the one we really need in this uh, for this video is going to be the the second one, the firmware. The two, the bottom two, I don't really use them. So, so the firmware. So as you can see, it's around 10, uh, 10 megabytes, and it came out in twenty twenty October October twenty third twenty twenty. So I'm recording this video in 2021, July, so some months ago, but that's the latest available. So there is an update for this um, printer, okay? So you click on download, you can read all that. It's very interesting what it does, what the updates are for. So you download it, it's like I said, it's very, it's 10 megabytes, it's almost nothing. 
So I already have it uh, here. And just you double click on it, and we're going to start. We're going to start the installation. Of course, the printer has to be connected to the computer, right? And it has to be on. So here, I'm going to do. I'm going to zoom in. It says select printer to update. So you click on that on this button, and you're going to see all the models. In my case, I only have one HP Laser Jet M101 to M106. So that's the only one I have. If you have many, well, you're going to you're going to see more. So then. The next step is going to be send firmware. So another way to print the configurations is you go, you go to print config on the left. You're going to see, you don't have to press for a few seconds like I did a few seconds ago. You can get it from here. So the video sped up here. This process took like mm, three minutes, something like that. It's, very, it's super quick, okay? It's not, it, it's quick. So uh, in the middle of the upgrade, the printer was doing something. I just want to show you. As you can see, it's blinking over there. Um, the alert, <coughs> the error message, and the green circle are blinking constantly. So I just wanted to show you because um, I noticed that. A little more about that. So it's blinking like that. So that's how it works. So just don't, don't be afraid about <laughs> that. So. I'm going to go back to the update. Again, the video sped up, so you don't have to wait all the time. So once it's done, you can see the happy face over there, and you can go to print config, so you, we can check if the upgrade has been successful. So we are going to print. We're going to click on print. And of course, it's going to print something, right? The video is sped up here as well. And I'm going to show you how this one looks. But I made a mistake. So I'm going to print it again because it was printing on top of something else. So you could, I was not able to read anything. So I'm going to print it again. And now this is going to be the correct one. So now I'm going to show you how it looks. And here, here, here you can see it. And if you go to firmware data code, date code, it says 2020, October 23. So that means we have the latest. The upgrade has been successful. And well, that's pretty much it. You have the latest version. So that's uh, the way you can confirm that you have the latest or you have done an upgrade, okay? So we go back to the desktop computer and we click okay and you just exit. So that's all I wanted to show you in this video, guys, how to do the upgrade for an HP home printer. So maybe now you want to watch these videos. And if you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe. If you have any other comment or questions, leave it in the comment section below. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.